This original video is supposed to be 15 minutes, but I can't remember which clips I was using. I hope this glitch goes by because I actually can't see anything. Uh, it froze. Um, but that's what I was originally doing, and then Dex got mad because Fort Hood is firing a lot of guns. Uh, Dex wasn't having it, but etc. Hold on, let me turn down the volume. And Dex wasn't having it, so I had to. Uh, uh, my controller died while I was out, so the thing ended up glitching, and I couldn't record audio, and I was not having that either, so I reset it. And I can't figure out what clips I put in there. It's supposed to be 15 minutes, now it's 17. So these are obviously different clips. I don't know. But what I really want to talk about is as cool as this Fortnite and Avengers Endgame crossover is, and as cool as all the LEGO games are, where are my actual Marvel games? Like, what? I... I want these Marvel games. Uh, I want more Marvel, but they haven't been releasing as many games as you would think. Why, why is Fortnite and Lego really all we get aside from Spider-Man and Ultimate Alliance? And Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite, like... Maybe I just want too much, but... I feel like there should be more. I don't know. Uh, Spider-Man PS4, I really want to get that eventually. Um, Marvel Ultimate Alliance 3. I have a Switch, so I can get it, but... Not sure if I want to. My brother basically owns the Switch. Of course, it's ours, so I use it occasionally, but... It's his, really. Um, so maybe I'll get another one eventually. Uh, I want to get a PS4, but I don't have a PS4 Pro. Uh, or I don't have a PS4. I want to get a PS4 Pro, because if I'm using my money, I'm going to get the best I can get, right? Um, and then... Uh, what was the other game? Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite already came out and it's really good, but not a whole lot of replay value, and the game just feels unfinished. Not glitchy or anything, just actually unfinished, like something's missing that's supposed to be there. There are a whole ton of characters that are missing, but I'm not talking about that. So, I don't know, we'll see, I guess, later on. Maybe. Uh, if there are any more Marvel games. Avengers Project is supposed to come out by Square Enix, but... No one knows when. I believe it was two years ago it was announced. Two, three, four, somewhere around that, and we know nothing about the game. Okay, the visuals on my end are still frozen. I can't commentate on the game. But I'm guessing by that sound, whatever team we're playing lost. And I think I'm Shatari, so... This is awkward. I'll be back. I'll let you guys enjoy it, because I know it's not still frozen on your end. Uh, see ya. It's still frozen on my end. 
Ah, oh, wait, 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 wait. Now it's back. Maybe it just wanted me to talk about it being frozen, so. Um, alright, we're back. I am currently diving. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, this mode is really fun. Uh, I believe in this, uh, I believe in this one I get... S Stormbreaker? I don't remember, though. In this run-through. Um, so yeah. But, uh... No, this is not the one with Stormbreaker. This is Cap's shield. <laughs> but this game is fun and all. Just, it's not a Marvel game. Where, where are my Marvel games, man? If they're licensing to Fortnite, though, you gotta think that, um... And if Fortnite had a cameo in, uh, Avengers Endgame, basically, um, you gotta think that, uh, um, licensing isn't so strict, so I guess they're just waiting to find the right people, um, to work on more stuff. Games that I hope get a sequel, though, or get, uh, con get continuations are, um, the Ultimate Alliance series for sure. Uh, I want some games that are like the X-Men Origins, Wolverine, and Deadpool kind of formula. Um, I want some games that are like, uh, Spider-Man VR, obviously, but, you know, for different characters. So, I said Spider-Man VR. Spider-Man PS4. Um, yeah, this is the one with, wait, this is Hawkeye's bow. This is not either of the things that I thought. Interesting. Mindstone has been taken, and Thanos is here. Oof. I'm disappointed that when they get all the sto um, stones, that Thanos can't just snap his fingers. That would be awesome. I'm not the only one who thinks so, right? <laughs> like, the goal is protecting the stones or whatever, and you gotta kill them or whatever. But, it would be so cool if he could just snap his fingers and you're gone. Instead, um, it just means that they're way stronger than they were originally. Um, I don't know how they're stronger, but it says that they're stronger. Um, and, um, that, uh, once they get all the stones, you can no longer respawn. So this mode's kind of cool in that regard, but nothing groundbreaking, I guess. Um, it's way cooler than the mode, uh, that they had a while ago where you get the Infinity Gauntlet and become Thanos. I became Thanos once. There's footage on my channel. Um, it was really fun, but I died a lot. So. And that was when I had Samsung Movie Maker. Get back here, Sam. Yeah, I don't know when I find any sort of competition or challenges in this video because really right now it's just walking. Walking is not a challenge. Oh, there's people here. I'm stone making them stronger. See, that's what each time they get a stone. Uh, also, when Thanos kills people, ah, ah, cold chill. When Thanos uh, kills people, he gets, um, there are like puns or whatever, like, uh, Thanos punched someone into space, or Thanos punched someone into- oh yeah, I was about to die because I think that was Thanos, or maybe that was a Shatari, it's hard to see, and I don't really remember. Oh yeah, I killed this guy. No, I didn't. What? I swear I did. I thought I did. I guess it's time to run. Evade! Fly! They're smarter than that. They were ready for that. That's another Shatari. There was just no getting away from me, this. Man, that's just like how Hawkeye died in Avengers Endgame. <gasps> spoilers, spoilers, I'm so sorry. No, I'm just kidding. That that he that didn't that doesn't happen. At least not like that. I'm just kidding. <sighs> By the time this goes up, you've already already seen the movie, so I can nor confirm or deny what happens in the movie. Okay. 
Okay, so we're switching to... <laughs> Wait, the fire... The fire transition actually works because of all the fire on screen. That's awesome. Because the fire transition was di was added by me, but there's actually fire here. That's awesome. Okay, um... Yeah. The, the, this game gets me back to that original topic of... This is cool and all, but where are my actual Marvel games? This is a Lego game, and I love these games, so I will continue to play and support them. I have all of the DLC with this game. I have everything. I've, I've bought everything for this game, is what I'm saying here. And, uh, obviously I bought the game. Um, I waited until there's a sale on it or whatever, because I didn't have a whole lot of money, but then, uh, when it was like five, when the premium version was five dollars, I was like, get! Because I was, I was gonna get it eventually, anyways. But I didn't have enough money. I don't have a job yet. I want to get a job, so... Um, since I don't have a job currently, I was just like, whatever. We gotta save Beth the waitress. That's apparently what the game calls her. Is Beth the waitress. So, you know, we save Beth the waitress, we're all good. We don't, we're not. This game is really fun. Not difficult by any means, for fun. Hey, I'm gonna do reviews on Avengers movies soon. Uh, or on all the MCU movies eventually. Um, and then once I get all of the movies, I will do re-reviews. So right now I can do a review on uh, Infinity War and uh, Civil War. I know it's a weird order, but or it's that's weird combination. But you know, uh, once I get the actual order or whatever, because I don't remember what all of them are, I'll re-review them in chronological order rather than the order they were released in. So it'll then be uh, it'll be Captain or First Avenger, um, Captain Marvel, Iron Man. I think is next. Uh, Iron Man 2, maybe. Then... Thor. Thor 2. Hulk. Avengers. I, I don't know. I'm gonna look up the order later. But the Shatari. Two videos with Shatari. That's interesting. I'm afraid I've got some bad what news, the... team. The helicarrier is still stranded. So you'll need to hold off Loki's army on your own until we can scramble some what reinforcements. The frick? Uh, sorry about that. I have unfinished business. What the fuck? Yeah? I'm getting in line. Save it. Loki's gonna keep the fight focused on us, and that's what we need. Without him, these things could run. I more. think there's an airplane outside. I don't know. I'm just being overreacting for comedy's sake. Oh, drop the hammer. Also, I'm not sure if my mom enjoys this as much as me, everyone else in the house, but, you know, Marvel and stuff. Um. But. We were, um, when we watched Endgame, my mom came out really enjoying it. Um, and then we were watching Civil War and she seemed invested in it or whatever, so. She, uh, I think she likes it and stuff, so. It, this is really a family thing. And we've seen every single X-Men movie except for Apocalypse, because, uh, right before Zack was born, we saw X-Men Origins Wolverine, and we liked the movie, but obviously it's not the best, um, movie ever. And uh, I don't even think it's the best, or it's like, a, I'm not, I don't think it's a good movie, but I really like it. Uh, I think it's a terrible movie. Uh, but, you know, guilty pleasure kind of thing. Except I don't really feel guilty about it, because if I like something, I like it. Um, with the few exceptions, I do have guilty pleasures where I'm just like, if anyone sees me watching this, I'm going to kill myself. <laughs> that kind of thing. Obviously, I don't think that strongly about other people's opinion of me. That's not, I don't. That doesn't work on me, you know, so... Um... But... Uh, I do like watching, uh... That terrible Mega Man cartoon. Um... That's on Cartoon Network. Like, it's really bad, and... Sometimes it's so bad that it just makes me, ups uh, like, actually, like, upset. Like, we could've gotten something good out of this. Like, we could've gotten something actually good. But I watch it because it's Mega Man, and sometimes I... Like watching the action scenes. But it is terrible. It's not even Mega Man. Like, it should be wiped from existence. It's that bad, but somehow I like it. But I won't miss it if it's gone, is what I'm saying. Like, please go away and get me something good. 
Mega Man's future is uncertain. Because we have this cartoon, and, uh, and then we haven't heard anything about games. There's no DLC for Mega Man 11. Trust me, if there were DLC for Mega Man 11, I'd have that, and I'd be reviewing that. So. Um, but anyways, games that I want um, for Marvel. Marvel vs. Capcom 5, Ultimate Alliance 4, Spider-Man PS4 2, and some other games in between uh, based on different Marvel characters that haven't really gotten their spotlight in video games. Uh, at least, <clears throat> haven't got justified amount of spotlight. Like, recently, there's been a surge, re like, so you remember I made my video on X-Men Origins Wolverine DS. I love the console version, I like it better actually, but I did a video on that, and then like, four months later, there was just a, a resurgence in interest in that game for some reason. I do not know why. I, it, it is not, it is definitely not because of my video. No one watched it. It has zero views. So it is not because of my video. But, um, it was just weird that there's been a resurgence in popularity in that, um, game. Uh, the console version, anyways. I think my video title was, The Best Wolverine Game Is One You've Never Played, or something like that. Um, and so, yeah, there was a resurgence in that. And then Deadpool is no longer on Xbox Live anymore. Uh, so, yeah. Deadpool messed up. Was that Stanley? Uh, yeah, it was. Okay. So I guess one of the Stanley and Peril things are here. I don't know if I'll show it. I don't know if I can, though, even, because this is on my other profile where I'm replaying the game. I have 100% of this game. So when I say, where are my real Marvel games, I don't think that this is a bad game. I have 100% of it, and I'm going to do it again. That's what this playthrough is for. Well, I mean, primarily this is for YouTube, but I'm going to 100% this again. I even have all of the achievements as of last night, so I'm going to do it again. I mean, I don't hate this game. I don't dislike this game, but this is not a Marvel game. I stress that enough, or I cannot stress that enough. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed. It is time for me to leave. Bye.